The city of Houston revealed several bodies that were supposed to be relocated from a historic black cemetery over in the Fifth Ward during a 1960s construction project. Well, they were recently found by Metro employees working on that project. Fox 26's Gabby Hart joins us live from Evergreen Cemetery with those details. Gabby. Uh, where I'm standing used to be a part of the cemetery that you see over to my left there, uh, also on the other side of this road. Uh, but in the 1960s, the city got permission to uh, remove these bodies, to uh, exhume them so that they could create a median here at this location. But the only thing is some of those bodies weren't respectfully removed. Uh, they were actually left behind right here. Uh, now, I can tell you uh, that today the cemetery uh, holds the bodies of former slaves soldiers, Fifth Ward, and Houston residents. Today, Mayor Sylvester Turner stood with local pastors, politicians, and leaders and talked about what a grave mistake this was, leaving these bodies here and how they plan to honor the remains found. Now, while Metro was working on the planning stage for a university rapid line, 33 grave sites were found. 30 of them, were told, had pieces and remnants of coffins and bones, and three of those sites actually had significant human remains inside of them, meaning that those bodies bodies were just missed altogether and left. And now we are faced in 2023 uh, with the task of um, honoring those who were buried here, their descendants, the people in this community. And how many predominant white cemeteries have you found with this challenge? Who's having this challenge in their community other than African Americans? Well, now, Mayor Turner has uh, stopped or halted that project and any work being done here uh, for the time being. Now, I can tell you that they are working on the process to uh, go ahead and identify the remains found and to figure out how uh, they can honor them. So, of course, we'll keep you posted and have much more on this story tonight at 9 o'clock. For now, I'm reporting live in Fifth Ward, Gabby Hart, Fox 26 News.